Hey up. Yeah, that's not going to work for me, I don't think. Hey guys, anyway, welcome back to my channel. Um, in today's video, I've create, recreated Jamie's go-to look with some of the products that I purchased um, from her meet and greet. Um, and in this video, I kind of tell you about what happened at the meet and greet and how exciting it was. Um, so yeah, um, if you want to see how I recreated Jamie's go-to look, please stay tuned. So um, this video is really exciting. Well, kind of exciting. Um, it was probably about two weeks ago now. Um, but if anybody knows me, um, I met my absolute idol, <laughs> and I like nearly started crying. Like it was ridiculous. Um, and that was Jamie Genevieve. Um, I got this jumper whilst she created her own lipstick. So some of these products that I'm going to use are just something that I kind of use on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, so I've literally got nothing on my face. As you can see, I woke up quite early on a Sunday, so please excuse my face. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go in with the Mario Badescu um, facial spray. It's the rose water one. It kind of just freshens up my face, gives me a bit of a boost and wakes me up a bit. So just a couple of sprays of that. Um, and it's just such a nice smell as well. Go in with a moisturiser. And it's the Total Moisture um, Moisturiser from Benefit. Um, it's quite a thick moisturiser this one, but it's just so nice. So yeah, um, I went with one of my workmates, Makeup by Madison, <laughs> shout out to you, um, and my best friend, Alex. Um, but yeah, it was <laughs> like the week before I was away in the lakes and um, with my boyfriend's family and like she like announced that she was doing this meet and greet and I couldn't contain my excitement but like none of them would have known like they wouldn't have understood why I was that excited um but my boyfriend did because he knows like how obsessed I am popping up to all my friends I was like you need to come with me like some of my friends aren't really into makeup um so I was like oh my god there's not gonna be anyone to go with and I was like at this point I'm just gonna go on my own like um, so I'm just gonna go in with my YSL glow shot drops so this is just a bit of a, an illuminator I like to pop any sort of illuminate underneath my foundation um, just to give me that sort of nice overall glow I wasn't really recommended this by anyone I just went to the counter and got the all hours foundation which was a recommendation from Jamie most of my products are recommendations of Jamie just because I trust her opinion I'm just gonna go straight in with foundation because this look um, it's not really an eye look and um, I'm just gonna do my skin first so like I said the YSL all I was foundation. I'm just going to pop a couple of pumps of that onto the back of my hand and then I'm going to use my BH Cosmetics brushes and just use a regular stipple brush and just sort of pack that on. So we got there and I'm actually in her vlog of that like literally seconds. I was quite sad that I didn't get picked to be in it for longer but whatever. Like, I still made it. <laughs> um, we got a few little bits. So we got a cupcake um, that had Jamie's name on it. Um, obviously we got the lipstick. Um, and we got <laughs> these of her lips. So now I'm going to go in with concealer. This concealer um, I think is the one that Mama -ma Mitchell uses. Um, it's the Barry M concealer but it's all faded already like on the back. I'm going to pop it under my eyes. Then I'm going to take another one of my BH Cosmetics brushes. It's quite a damp, dense brush, but slightly fluffy. And I just like to sort of pat that on. I don't like to like brush it in, because that's when it like makes streak marks. So just patting that in, and I think that gives it a real nice sheen. I've also been doing something a bit different for me. Um, I've not been using a powder bronzer on my face. I've just been using um, like a darker concealer shade. So this is the NYX uh, Studio Photogenic HD Concealer um, in shade 07. The first time I did this, I put too much on and I was like so brown. Um, but all I've been doing is sort of a little line down there to contour the sides of my face. Um, and I did do my nose before, but um, again, it made me too brown. <laughs> and then just little arrows up there like that. And then I'm just going to go in with my foundation brush again um, and just buff that into 
into the skin. I've just been going in with my new by nature translucent powder just into my eyes. And then clean that side up. I have finally had my eyebrows done, thank God. Um, so I'm just gonna go in with this little bit of product. Jamie lately's just been doing her brows fairly natural. Um, so I'm not going to put loads of product in, but because I've got quite angled brows anyway, any product in there can make them look quite full on. So, but I'm just going to put the tiniest bit in. And that's pretty much it for the brows. I'm just rimmel, clear gel, and just pop a few swoops of that in. I like to like brush them up at the front. I've kind of been into like sort of feathered brows. I know they're not completely feathered, um, but just a little bit. Just to make them look a bit more natural. I'm gonna crack on with eyes. So she has been doing um, just like a big wing with a lash. I'm just gonna do that off camera and I'll come back. I've done my eyeliner. Um, I've done it a little thinner than usual. Every time I do our eyeliner, it's a little bit different every time. Just glue these guys up. And these are the Love Lace Lashes from Doll Beauty, which you'll see in a minute. Yeah, for me, um, it's not that important to have an amazing mascara because I've been, like, I wear lashes pretty much every day. I either wear lashes or I don't wear any makeup. I'm just using a Rimmel um, mascara. It's the Extreme Black Volume Colorist. Right, and then we'll go back with the mascara afterwards for the bottom lashes as well. All I need to do now is pop a bit of blush on. I've been using the Milani Baked Blush. Um, this has been going sort of viral. I've seen a lot of YouTubers using this one. Um, and I wasn't really a blush kind of girl before, um, but it is just a nice little natural glow. Um, and I'm just going to go in with another BH Cosmetics brush. It's more of like an angled, fluffy brush. Um, and you don't need a lot of this, just a couple of taps. It's slightly like pearlized, um, which kind of just makes it look a bit more natural. And it gives you that extra highlight as well, which I really like. Um, the lashes need to dry a bit more. I'm going to show you um, the products that I did purchase, which is the main part of this video. Um, so basically, um, we got the lipstick included, which is in my bag. <laughs> um, stripped down uh, lip liner from MAC. Because um, Jamie just uses like a darker lip liner with her nude lipstick. And this is the lipstick. As you can see, it's just a beautiful nude which I'll be popping on in a second. Yeah. You got the lipstick, um, and then basically, if you wanted the jumper, which is here, you had to spend another 40 pounds, which I was like, oh my God, I'm a student, I don't have this money, but I need to, and I purchased, um, basically all that was on offer was like Jamie's favorites. Um, so I purchased the Oh Darling highlight, which is absolutely amazing. As you can see here, I've been using it quite a bit. And I've been using it sort of in the inner corners of my eye. Stamping my brush with this amazing setting spray. So I've been wanting the Fix Plus spray for a while because I've heard so much about it. Yeah, I got the gold fleck one. And it smells amazing. I'm going to pop some highlighter on. So I'm just going to delve into my Morphe brushes. Do the inner corner of my eye first. A little dense brush like this. Again, the Morphe brushes don't have numbers on them, so I'm sorry about that. Give the Fix Plus spray a bit of a shake, and then I'm just going to squirt onto my brush. So I'm just going to pop it in the inner corner of the eye, and I like to bring it just a bit further down to really open my eye. Bring it down a little bit. It's just something that I like to do. So I'm going to pop my lashes on. So I'm just going to do that off camera. So I'm back. Those lashes are on. They look a little bit crazy right now because I've not got the mascara on my bottom lashes um, so I'm just gonna whack a bit of the mascara on my bottom lashes finish off the highlight on my face so again with the O Darling highlighter I'm just gonna take um, a fluffy brush this was um, a eyeshadow brush but I've decided to use it for my highlight now it's just a little bit smaller you can like just get a bit more precise with your highlighter so I've just given a couple of squirts of the fix plus and I just like to do a circular motion like look at that already Hardly put any on. Circular motions. Wow. Dang. Same on the other side. Like you don't even need to wet your brush. Like because it's that amazing already. I just like to be excessive. And then just bringing that up there. Just down the bridge of my nose. Which is something Jamie does. Tin man nose as she calls it. Cupid's bow, 
and then just above the brows there just to really highlight the face and now I'm gonna put the lipstick on which is the favorite part of the video the main part of the video and um, so I'm just gonna go in with the stripped down lip liner which will look a bit crazy at first because it's so dark but trust me use my natural shape so at the minute it looks a bit crazy I'm just going to bring the brown into the lip get the lipstick I'm just going to get the Fix Plus spray and give my Give my face a bit of a spritz. I'd literally coat myself in that all day if I could. Um, but yeah, that is the finish look. Yeah, everyone was like, oh my god, you look so similar in like the pictures and stuff, which I'll post um afterwards. But yeah, it was just a really mental like experience um for me because I've been watching her since day one, like from when she was literally doing this in her bedroom when she was my age. Um, so yeah, she's my absolute idol. Um, but yeah, that is the finished look with my Mac jumper on. <laughs> um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye guys.